friends welcome back to my channel this is Cheryl with I style my style and in today's video I am going to be talking to you about timeless and elegant pieces today we are going to concentrate specifically on dinnerware and the decor that you add to your table so if you do not know I love to thrift Thrifting is one of my passions and I love to go out and find things that I can incorporate into my home to make them look really elevated and sophisticated and to make my home look a lot more expensive than it really is. So when I go out thrifting, I look for pieces that I can use year round and over and over again pieces that will stand the test of time and I don't have to keep buying them over and over. So that is what we are going to talk about today. So I have put together this tablescape. If you do not know, I love black and white and black and white are my signature colors. And those are the colors I use to decorate around my home. Now I know not everyone's taste is very simple like mine. A lot of people like to use color and you can also incorporate these tips when you are out shopping for your own dinnerware. So one of the things I look for when I'm out shopping is glasses. You guys, I have talked about this many, many times before. Always go to the Goodwill when you are looking for your glassware. I picked these glasses up from the Goodwill and they were only 25 cents a piece. Yes, 25 cents a piece, you cannot beat that price. And I also thrifted my dinnerware. China is one of the things that you can find readily available at any thrift store. You can find them sometimes in a set, sometimes they're not in a set, but they're broken apart, or you can find something similar that you can put together to create your own unique look. So this dinnerware I picked up from the Goodwill, it was 50 cents a piece, and I also picked up these little salad plates. Now you can see they are a different pattern, but they go well and play nicely together. So total cost for the plate and the salad plate was a dollar. Now to elevate the look, I have added this charger plate that I picked up on clearance from Z Gallery, oh gosh, several years ago. Um, as you can see, it was $16.99 a plate. I did not pay that much. I think it was around $3 a plate. And I picked up a set of six because that is what my table seats. But I also picked up two extra plates. That is another tip. Always buy extra in case something breaks, then you will always have a spare piece on hand. So just by adding the plate, or the um, Z Gallery charger, which is very expensive looking, paired with our $1 plates that we picked up from the Goodwill. This gives us a very sophisticated, modern and elegant look. To go along with the setting, I am using this velvet placemat that I picked up from Home Goods. Oh no, it wasn't Home Goods. I picked it up from Hobby Lobby. As you can see, the detail is so pretty. It's got a velvet sheen to it. I picked it up last fall, I believe, or springtime, it was from the spring shop. You know how Hobby Lobby always puts things on clearance, 66% off, then I think it's 70 or 90%. But anyway, I picked these up from Hobby Lobby for 90% off. They were normally $3.99, so I paid $0.39 cents a piece for these placemats. And as you can see, that also gives the table a very elegant, elevated look. Now, I also thrifted this Lucite silverware. You guys know I love everything to be sophisticated and modern, and this silverware fits the bill. I picked this up from eBay. 
um, last year or the year before, after I saw Tammy Roberts feature some Lucite silverware in one of her haul videos. After that, I was on the hunt. And so I was so happy when I found these on eBay. I picked up a set, it was like 66 pieces for like $60. So a dollar a piece for each piece of silverware. And guys, I absolutely love it. And again, it just elevates the place setting. Now on to the centerpiece. The centerpiece is a runner that I picked up from Target several years ago at Christmas time. It was also on clearance and it only cost me $5. It is a velvet material, very luxurious. And as you can see, it goes very well with my table setting. Now, you guys will see, you've probably already saw the video where I DIY these vases, but I absolutely love them. They give me the high end look from the ones that I saw at Crate and Barrel, and I will put up a photo here, and I achieve the same look using items that I found thrifting. So I picked up these canisters from the Goodwill over time. That's another tip. When you're out thrifting, you don't find your pieces all at once. You will find them over time. So I picked these up, they were $1.99. I found two of those, and then I found this piece. I don't remember what it was, but I think it was like $4.99. And then I'm also using these vases that I picked up from the Dollar Tree. And I just did a simple technique on them to elevate them to the next level. So if you missed that video, I will leave a link in the iCards above, as well as in the description box below. So you can go check out how I created these fantastic vases for a lot less than the look they are giving. So I love creating look for less tablescapes and vignettes. And I absolutely love how this one came together. Now you guys know I have also been playing around with changing my chairs. I couldn't decide if I wanted to buy new chairs or to use the ones I already have. So what did I do? I just changed the color with some chair covers that I picked up from Amazon. Think outside the box, guys. You don't always have to go out and buy new furniture. You can change the look by just adding a cover. So that is what we have done here. Again, my colors are black and white. So it pairs perfectly well in my home. You can find your color in, um, on Amazon as well and change out the way your table or your furniture looks. There's chair covers for everything. You can find them at Ikea, Amazon, Pottery Barn. They're more expensive at Pottery Barn, but you can certainly find them there. So I would recommend Ikea or Amazon. Now, the last two items I am going to talk about are these beautiful napkin rings that my boyfriend purchased for me for Christmas. I absolutely love them. I don't know if you can see the detail. Let me take one out. We are going to use these to finish off our table setting. These are very luxurious, as you can see and look at the sparkle on the geodes guys you know i've been loving restoration hardware he knows it too he sees my inspired dupes all over the house so he was so sweet and he purchased these for me and i am so happy and i cannot wait to style them on my tablescape so today i am going to show you how i use them and i also have these napkins now I pick these up from Williams Sonoma. You know, Williams Sonoma is very expensive, but I always like to look for clearance items. And this one doesn't have a price, but I think it was like $10 for this set of six. And these napkins are really, really nice. So I'm going to take them out and we're gonna style the table with them. Let me see if I can undo this really quick. 
so you can see what I mean. Okay, so as you can see, this has a gray piping along the side that has sort of a sateen sheen. Now these will need to be ironed, but for today's purposes, we're gonna skip that step and I'm just gonna put this together and I'm gonna come back and show you how they look. Today's video is part of a collaboration that I am co-hosting with a wonderful friend here on YouTube and that is Lady Phoenix from Really Good Living. I will leave a link for Ladies Phoenix channel down below, as well as a link of the list of the playlist of all the participants. If you did not know, Lady Phoenix loves all things home decor like I do. She loves the modern and elegant and bling um, home decor. She just loves it. And I love to watch her channel. And when she's happy and she finds something that she really likes, she always sings, it's so beautiful. <laughs> I really like that about her. So please make sure you go and check out Lady, Phoenix, Lady Phoenix's channel. If you are not already familiar with her, you will get tons of home decor. All right, so here is how our finished table looks. And I absolutely love these napkin rings, guys. You must pick these up if you love geodes. I absolutely love these. And look how perfect they go with our napkins that we got on clearance from William Sonoma. This whole tablescape has been put together with pretty much everything clearance or from the Goodwill, with the exception of my gift that was given to me of these very pretty geode napkin rings from Z Gallery. Everything else came from the Goodwill, 50 cents a piece for each glass and each plate. The silverware was a dollar a piece. The plates from Z Gallery, the gray ones were also on clearance, again for about $3 a piece. Napkin ring or the placemat, 39 cents. The napkins themselves were like, I think $10 from William Sonoma. And I will leave a link for them um, if I can find them still down below as they were on clearance. Our placemat was $5, also clearance, and our glass vases were also from the Goodwill. Now, when you put the look all together, you have a very modern and elegant tablescape. And that is what today's video is all about, how to show you how to decorate with timeless and elegant pieces on a budget. And today's video has been part of a collaboration that I am co-hosting with a wonderful friend here on YouTube, and that is Lady Phoenix from Really Good Living. I will leave Lady Phoenix's channel down below, as well as a link for the playlist of all the participants who will join us for this wonderful, timeless and elegant collab. So guys, I hope you have learned some tips for today. Always think outside the box, you do not have to go out and spend tons of money to make your home look elegant. You can do it through thrifting and buying things on clearance and save yourself a lot of money. So I hope you have learned a lot today, my friends. And if you are new here, welcome. My name is Cheryl. I love decorating my home with style on a budget and trying to make it look a lot more expensive than it really is. So if that is something you are into as well, and you want to save money this year, as we all do. And if you want to save money this year, that is part of my New Year's resolution. And I'm sure that we all do. Please make sure you hit the subscribe button and tap the notification bell and become a member of the iStyle MyStyle family. So my friends, until next time, I hope to see you in the next video.